there, Stephanie of Stephanie Stitches here. Welcome to my channel where together we sew. If you're brand new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and ring the bell for notifications so you'll know when I post up videos like this one or when I go live. And if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. I love seeing all of you here and your comments down below. I really, really appreciate each and every one of you. I've had a lot of new people subscribe during the last few weeks and that means the world to me. <laughs> this crazy journey that I've been on has been so much fun. It's a lot of work to make these videos every day, but I've really, really enjoyed being here with all of you. And I just am dumbfounded that you all want to support this shy, introverted Ohio girl. <laughs> so thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, I wanted to say that first. Second, um, yesterday I asked you guys about what your favorite block was, if you're a quilter. A lot of you said churn dash, log cabin, stars, all those kind of things. Uh, most of you know what my favorite block is, but I'll tell you for, especially because we do have some new people, my favorite is the Ohio star. I pretty much like any star block. I love stars, um, uh, but the Ohio star is my favorite. So yes, um, that's my favorite. And some of you said that, and a lot of you said the friendship star, which is great. Um, and I saw one answer that said you like the friendship star because you like to fussy cut the center of those. And that's perfect. That block is perfect for that. So very cool. Lots of, <coughs> excuse me, <laughs> lots of really neat blocks out there. I need some more coffee. It's too early. Uh huh. <laughs> that helped. Um, lots of really neat blocks that you guys mentioned. So thank you for mentioning that. Okay. I'm going to stop talking now because apparently I can't do that this morning. <laughs> We're going to get to the admins. This is the Ginger Coulter Advent Day 11 gift, and this is probably my favorite gift so far. Um, there's actually been some good things in the Ginger Coulter Advent, but Orophil, I love Orophil thread, and this is all I use in one eye piece. So getting a large spool, yep, that makes me happy. <laughs> so, so far, this is my favorite thing out of the Ginger Coulter Advent box. There have been good things in this box though, so I'm not saying anything negative. It's just that that's how much I love Orofil. <laughs> All right, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so here's the advents for Cotton Cats, the Fabric Advent, and the Notions Advent. I think I opened the Notions first yesterday, so I'm gonna open the Batik today. So this is gonna keep going through 24 days. This is gonna end tomorrow, should be last six. I think there was 12. The Ginger Coulter ends at 12, and Sunny Path Fabrics and um, Cotton Cuts goes to 24, and we got another yellow. You know, <laughs> I was loving this Batik thing, and I don't dislike it. It feels really nice. This one feels good. That stripey one did not feel good. I will tell you that. And the flowery yellow one felt good, too. But now we have three yellows, and yellow is not my favorite, so just a little bit disappointed that this is another yellow but we still have more than 10 days so hopefully there'll be no more yellow <laughs> and there'll be some more colors that i like so okay um probably day 12 i'll go over the the whole everything we've gotten color wise so far and also like things we've gotten from the advents especially the ones that end so Measure twice, cut once was the same on this one. And let's see. These are rulers. Um, it says double sided for right or left hand use. I'm not really sure what these rulers are used for. Maybe one of you know that. They're not quilting rulers because they're flappy. Um, yeah. Interesting notion today. That's what I'm going to say about that. <laughs> so this is the Sunny Path at uh Sunny Path Fabric um quilt shop advent. And oh. It's another one of the fabrics in the line that we've been getting the Art Gallery Fabric line. Um it was called Little Town by Amy Simps. Oh, I can almost talk. Amy Cinebaldi. Um, it's way too early. I need to drink more coffee. <laughs> it's so soft, just like all the other ones, and beautiful. And let me see if I can hold it closer. 
it's not coming quite across this the color that it is but it's a teal green it's more towards the green than teal but it still has like that teal component it's not just green green this is gorgeous and with those little berries mm, I love this okay I will definitely pull out all the fabrics we've gotten so far from cotton cats and sunny path tomorrow so you guys can see them all I'll kind of do that every I guess few days and show you what we're looking at so far this is beautiful and it's super soft just like all the rest of them okay so opinion on the advents today liked the thread from the ginger culture box of course I love orophil that's all used a piece I use orophil to piece because I know people ask me this all the time I use um, King Tut or Glide to long arm um, but orophil is definitely my go-to for piecing um, so that was a good one of course I like the art gallery fabrics from um, Sunny Path the, their advent and cotton cuts it's kind of disappointing today but it was one day it every other day I've really liked um, except for that yellow <laughs> the yellow stripey the yellow floral I liked the yellow floral batik and uh, the print on today's wasn't bad but I'm not a huge fan of yellow so getting three pieces of yellow I'm hoping there's no more yellow <laughs> fingers crossed so um, maybe they got all of the yellow out of the way and then I don't have to worry about any more yellow that would be wonderful <laughs> okay so let's go beyond that um, thank you guys so much for being here again I like I said at the beginning I really love seeing you here I really truly mean it um, today I I get asked all the time like what are my favorite notions so today I'd love to know what your favorite notion is um, whether you're a sewer or a quilter or even just a crafter because you guys have some obviously that's not sewing notions but you guys have tools that you use um, so my two favorite notions currently and this one will probably never change is the acorn easy press uh, fabric treatment pen precision pen you guys know how much I love this thing I'm not gonna explain it again because y'all see me use it all the time you know how much I love it and I have it in my video about um, you know my tips for accuracy and faster piecing um, and also which I'll link that video at the end here if you haven't seen it also my other favorite notion if I had to say notion of the year because the easy press I've had for years um, before that even came to America I used to buy it from Sparrow quilt company in Canada and that was the only place you could get it so I had to ha bring you know bring it over the border so it's very expensive <laughs> but I fell in love with it um, but that was years ago so I've been using that product for probably six years maybe so that's nothing new but this um, is something newer to the market it's not new in the last year but it's really taken off in the last year although it could have been new in the last year hmm see now I don't know the first time I ever saw it let's put it this way the first time I ever saw it in the market was last January but was this um, binding ease from quilted hearts this is my favorite this is my notion of the year if I had to pick a notion of the year um, this makes binding go so fast just like that like to me the worst part about binding is making the binding because folding it ironing it it gets hot you burn your fingers mm. <laughs> this eliminates all of that I love this and this is also in my tips video so if you haven't seen this yet and you're looking for that nice gift for a quilter friend or even for yourself or you want to if somebody says to you you know I want to buy you a gift for your quilting hobby for Christmas what would you like if you want something special I would get this this is really really cool and this comes in this blue or it comes in like a salmon pink kind of color um, of course I picked the blue <laughs> but this would be my notion of the year so I will actually link this down below in case you're interested because there's only a few spots you can get it it's not sold everywhere yet I can't get it through my distributor um, you can get it directly from the people who sell it, it's website that manufacture it and just a couple other shops so they don't sell on Amazon so if you find this on Amazon it's um, not it's a fake um, they don't sell they only sell to smaller quilt shops they don't sell to big shops at least not that I know of yet I haven't seen it at any big shops yet and they don't sell to distributors like um, notions distributors because I can't get it through my distributor so I will link their shop directly if you're interested so I don't sell that so that's not profiting me I'm that's what I'm telling you when I show you guys something like that is because I really love it so <laughs> 
I'll get off my soapbox now and you tell me what your favorite notion is or a notion that you would like you would like to have if you don't have a favorite notion um, that's about it I it's pretty early this morning <laughs> I need to finish my coffee and go get my shower uh, <laughs> I got my mom bun going on right now um, and it, in a few hours, a little later today, I'm going to, um, film the next Missouri Star Box opening with Steven. That was so much fun last week. I really, really enjoyed opening with him. You guys got to see our genuine reactions. Um, we have not opened any more packages yet. And he and I have been avoiding videos at all costs. <laughs> and a few of you have actually left me comments in on some of the videos like oh you're gonna love this on day and i was like click because i don't want to see it i don't want to know so don't tell us um but we're gonna film that tomorrow so look for that this upcoming wednesday um i'll have a ufo video this week uh i've got more giveaways this week and this coming thursday um we're gonna have all kinds of fun stuff because it's my birthday <laughs> so stay tuned it's gonna be another fun week and can't believe it but we're not that far from Christmas now guys two weeks <laughs> that's insane I can't believe I'm saying two weeks I can't believe it's two weeks away anyway all right have a great day happy Sunday and I'll see y'all soon bye, bye.